Hi, I'm Daniel, assistant producer and senior QA at Drinkbox Studios. And I'm Josh, a fellow QA person here at Drinkbox. We're here to show you some gameplay of our action RPG, Nobody Saves the World. You play as Nobody, who discovers that the evil calamity has reawakened, just as the ultra-powerful magician Nostromagus has gone missing. Ah! You're trying to locate Nostromagus to get his help, but in the meantime, you find his wand, which lets you transform into a bunch of different forms. That's right. As your forms level up, they unlock new abilities and even more forms, which you can see here. They level up by completing quests, which are these little challenges tailor-made for each form that you do as you go through the game's many dungeons. And let's fast forward a little and take a look at one of those dungeons right now. We're in this sort of gritty jail area called the Clank at the moment. Right, and as you can see here, this game has online co-op. When you're in co-op, the game gets a little harder to compensate for having two players. Daniel is using the rat form, and I'm using the horse. Together we make a pretty mediocre petting zoo. Oh, a beautiful, mediocre pair <laughs> of animals. I'll be able to unlock another ability for the rat if I complete one of the rat's quests. And there we go. The rat's ranked up, and I've unlocked a new skill. This is one of my favorite skills in the game, Detonate Poison. The rat is really good at poisoning enemies, and this skill lets me basically blow up any enemies that are poisoned all at once. It's pretty powerful. So one of the major concepts of Nobody Saves the World is that once you unlock customization, forms can equip abilities from all other forms. This lets you create a lot of really interesting synergies between skills. I'm just going to go into the menu for a second, and I'm going to give my horse the ranger's poison tipped ability, which makes all of my attacks apply poison. The horse's gallop ability lets it run around super fast and damage enemies it hits, so I'll be able to poison them really quickly and then you can detonate even more enemies. Nice. <laughs> That's pretty great, but we can make it even better. Like, I can equip Quick Cooldown, which will lower the time it takes to use Detonate Poison again, so I can use it more often. And I can put Stat Explosion on my horse, so that I trigger an extra explosion immediately when poisoning enemies. Two explosions per enemy sounds pretty good to me for sure. Oh yeah. So this was just a couple of examples of how we could quickly synergize both our builds to play off each other, but there's so much more to discover in the final game. Totally, and by playing in co-op, you basically double your opportunities of making wild combos happen. Thanks for your time, everyone. We hope you check out Nobody Saves the World when it comes out in early 2022.